global aircraft forecasts are always something of heightened interest to me. It's fun to be able to better understand what aircraft manufacturers predicting are necessary for markets right around the world. And today's coverage sits on the Pacific region, a region very close to my heart given that I grew up and was born in none other than Melbourne, Australia. And given we've just had the 2023 Australian International Air Show, I had the opportunity to attend and also be invited to the market forecast conducted by Airbus, where Airbus officials were in attendance to discuss forecasts. Airlines based in the Pacific region are expected to welcome 920 new aircraft over the next 20 years, per the latest Airbus global market forecast. Airbus's chief representative for Australia, New Zealand and the Pacific spoke in Melbourne to select media revealing the grand plans. Included in the 920 aircraft are 750 single aisle jets. Now these are your A320 family aircraft and Airbus A220 family. Meanwhile, the expectation is there'll finally be 170 wide bodies that'll be present. The wide bodies will include A330 Neos and A350s. As Airbus no longer produces the world's largest passenger plane, the A380 anymore, there's really only a select few aircraft types that are available. Interestingly enough, more than half of the aircraft that will be required are for growth in the market. So we'll see some 55% of the 920 aircraft being applicable to growth. Meanwhile, 45% will be there to replace the currently existing aircraft that will need to be moved on. Qantas is one of the biggest drivers for new aircraft as they revolutionize their group with a new single aisle fleet of aircraft, including the A321XLR and also notably the A220. We are already seeing a steady recovery in the global air traffic and a renewed confidence in the growth of the industry. These comments from Stephen Forshaw, the chief representative for the Pacific region. He concluded just by saying that it's particularly evident the growth and renewed confidence in that Pacific region. As we know, we're seeing a fantastic surge in travel demand there, with increases in flights to key destinations and new ones being launched. The ambition to have this many aircraft readily available should only improve that. Globally, there is the expectation there'll be a need for 39,490 new aircraft over the next 20 years, so it looks like I'm in for a very, very long run of discussing aircraft deliveries for you. Because, at the end of the day, the aviation industry never sleeps, and that is the beautiful thing about being involved in such an amazing community hobby, passion, and industry. Thank you very much for watching. You can let me know down below in the comments your opinions on the forecast. Do you believe the 920 aircraft will be beneficial? Where would you want to see them go? And what types would you want to see ordered specifically by airlines based in the Pacific region? That could be your Qantas's, your Air New Zealand's, maybe Virgin Australia, or something else in between. Thanks for watching. Take care. Stay tuned for more aviation content to come in the future.